Let's play video games! Hello, and welcome back to Binding of Isaac Rebirth. You're on the gaming channel, Hard on Gaming, where the games are hard and so am I. Alright, we're in basement level 2 of Mom's uh, basement. Last episode, I got not a whole heck of a lot. I got some flies, and I got HP up. And really nothing else. Not very impressive, really. Alright, so I got a heart there, I got a coin. Uh, there's no rocks for me to blow up. So a few episodes, I was talking about um, Minecraft server that I've been setting up. And um, I figured I'd talk about that a little bit more. Basically, the Minecraft server that uh, I'm setting up, it's got a lot of changes to try and uh, fit the uh, low-tech aesthetic of um, like fantasy games. Um, trying to trying to have a focus on very low-tech. Uh, magic and such, um, and it, it's been kind of difficult uh, being able to uh, try and think of what kind of changes I could make to it uh, to try and fit that aesthetic. But I think I've gotten it pretty close to the uh, ideal theme. Uh, are you a wizard? I'm not sure what that does. Where basically, uh, you start off, there's, um, ore doubling has been made a very late game mechanic. Uh, oh, Jesus Christ. Alright, I don't need to be there. Um, so yeah, uh, ore doubling is like a mid to late game mechanic. What is that? I'm really curious. Um, hmm. How do I get that? Let's see if I put a bomb here and push it over there. Hey, that did it. Ah, that blew the. Oh shit. Okay. Oh, oh dear. This has become a lot more complicated. Uh, Callus, your feet feel stronger. I don't know what that did. So anyway, uh, or doubling late game mechanic or mid to late game anyway. Um, I have a key I can get in here. The Pretty much the highest level tech that I'm allowing in the game is something that uh, can't really be reached until uh, the very late game. Um, automation is uh, pretty hampered by the fact that you don't get the luxury of um, a bunch of the stuff that uh, that most other mods will offer. So this is really tricky. Oh crap! Crap in a hat. Crap in a hat. Okay. So like, um, mace rating is is uh, somewhat a difficult thing to get to um, and I tried to keep a lot of multi-block structure stuff in the game because that's pretty much my favorite kind of stuff to see in Minecraft mods is multi-block stuff it just it makes it feel like it's a lot more interesting um, oh. What the hell? Alright, I can go around this way. Oh yeah, secret room. <laughs> so yeah, I like the multi-block stuff. I like, um... I like things to be kept low-tech. Um... And as for magic, uh... I wanted there to be... Oh shit, it's Dingle. Uh, 
as for magic, I wanted the. Oh shit! I got bullet tears. That's neat. Um, I wanted there to be like a light and dark type of magic. Basically, something that uh, could like be a yin and yang type situation. And I think I've come pretty close to achieving that. And I'm, for the most part, pretty happy about it. Um, but just trying to configure everything has really taken a long time. Oh, shit. I always forget what the, uh, what the tell is for when he's going to charge like that. Oh, there we go. Fantastic. Now I just gotta deal with the pooples. Oh. I unlocked the devil room. What is this? Uh, whoa. Fantastic. I got a box of stuff. Um, I'll get a heart. There's a pill there. Pretty fly. Oh! So that increased the number of flies that I had. Um, do I want to use this card now? Probably not. Luck of the draw. Okay. Don't, what do I want to keep? Do I want to keep this? Oh, I think the callus helps me on the uh, spikes. I don't know if that. Um, does less damage to me when I'm on spikes, or eliminates all the damage. Well, you know what? I'll keep the Ace of Spades, I think. Alright, let's go over here. Um, hmm, what do I want to get? Problem is, I never know what any of these items do. So anything I get is just luck of the draw, really. Uh, that costs two hearts. I don't want to do that. So I don't know what that is. Alright, let's get this. Wealth, but at what cost? Alright. So I guess that means that I get more... More whatchamacallit? I don't know. I have no idea. Something. Um, you know what? Let, let's use this card. Can I use it? How do I use it? Shit, I already forgot the control for it. Uh, Q. Oh! Okay, that's crap. Um, I could put coins into that. Let's see if I get anything. Probably just gonna waste my coins. Yeah. I got a coin. Eh, whatever. Alright, down a level. But anyway, uh, back to talking about Minecraft. Uh, I think one of the most difficult things uh, when setting up a server with a custom mod pack is the fact that uh, you really have to try and come up with something new and interesting. Um, and the problem is like a lot of mods are really just overdone, in my opinion. Like, they're in every single mod pack, and like, now a lot of mod packs um, are using the hardcore questing mod, which I kind of think is garbage. I don't like the hardcore questing mod because it doesn't feel like you're actually uh, doing any kind of any kind of quests or anything. It's like, you're being rewarded by an in-game item uh, for doing whatever tasks is decided by the uh, whoever set up the quests and I don't know I just don't like that in fact the only thing I really like about it is the fact that um, it does uh, add those it adds like um, a new mechanic to playing hardcore where if you run out of hearts 
that is permadeath. That I kind of like, but um, uh, everything else about it, it, it just doesn't seem fluid. Oh, come on. Come on. Would you please? Alright, so he only he only makes himself vulnerable if I'm not attacking. Okay. That's good to know. Oh, okay. Uh, lemon mishap. Okay, so what this power-up does, as I've learned before, is it makes you wet yourself. That's why it's called the lemon mishap. So you leave a little uh, yellow puddle around you that will damage any mobs that walk over it. Kind of like uh, how many mobs will um, create an environmental hazard for you. Uh, let's see, what else is in this room? Uh, is there over there? Actually, I think that's where I came from. Uh, do I want to do this? I don't know. Oh. This has really short range. Oh good, it's Stinkle. Or whatever the fuck it is. I don't know. It's a poop. And it creates pooples. Uh, what is this? The sun! Uh, I don't need that. What is this? It is the same card. Great. Uh, well, let's use this. This... Oh, it brings me here. Okay. So, I guess that card brings you there every time. Fantastic. Uh, well, I can take one of these cards anyway. So I have a little bit of an insurance policy should my health get too low. Um, Alright, let's go in here. Um, Alright, let's use this. There we go. Whoa! I wasn't expecting that to happen. What is this? It's the sun, again. Alright. Whatever. <laughs> wow, I got a lot of those cards. Jesus. Alright, let's go over here. Uh, that room is locked. That's a challenge room. I think I need full health to get in there. Oh, no. What? Come on. Alright, hear himself a little bit there. Ugh. He is actually doing more damage to himself than I am doing to him. Ugh. Oh, Jesus. Well, the good thing is, this eliminates the uh, possibility of any secret rooms. Oh, that's not good. Oh, no! Ugh, good. I thought that blast was going to hit me through the through the block there. <laughs> what does this do? Mr. Boom, a reusable bomb buddy. Oh, so I guess this is like a bomb that regenerates. I think I'll actually keep this instead of the... Uh, the lemon party. Uh, oh, Jesus. Um, da, 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 da. Oh, spiders! Is there... No, there isn't. Oh, no! Go away! Alright. So, that was a waste. Uh, well, I can go back. I can get uh, this other sun card. If I run over it, um, I guess there's really nothing else to do. I could. Oh, I already found the secret room. What was in the secret room? Wait a minute. Was I in the secret room? I don't remember. All right, let's put a bomb there. What? What? 
So how do I get in the secret room? Alright. There we go. Huh. Oh. Uh, sure. Why not? Well, that was useless. I wasted all my coins. Fantastic. Alright, let's go. And in fact, I've been going for over 15 minutes. Oh, Jesus. I'm going to have to beat this room before I do anything else. Uh, that's interesting. They kind of like arc. And they have magnetic tears. They don't have too much range, which is good. Oh. I'm angering them. Alright. Uh, that one dropped a battery. Alright, after I clear out this room, I'll end the video. Ooh. Okay. Some are down. Let's try and get them from this side. So the tears keep some kind of momentum, which is interesting, but not a whole lot. All right. So that was that room cleared. Um, I'll come back next time and I will. Uh, finish this level and until then I will see you in space. Goodbye internet I bet you were expecting some sort of fancy outro Nope Just this But hey, you know what would be cool? Clicking one of those links below Yeah That'd make it cool